back foot. Runners sent on their way from the 1400 meter marker. Age of Elegance is right there shortly after the start. Colonel Bling is near the rail. The orange cap going off to lead them of Roy's horse. On the outside, Catch the Fox is strong. Spirit of Dover's on the outside. That's got the blue cap. Winter Axe Race is about three lengths off the leader at this stage. They're followed further back in the field by Handsome Harvey, the yellow blinkers. That race is about six lengths off the lead. Then comes the duck, gold sails on the outside. So Earl Grey, your favourite, that's the grey about seven or eight lengths off the leaders at the 700 metre marker. And then comes Forever, that's got about eight or nine lengths to make up, followed by Lucky Shot and Roy's Dream the Trailer. As they turn into the home stretch and they come to the 500 metre marker, Roy's horse is the leader. Down the inside, Colonel Bling. Handsome Harvey's got the yellow blinkers. Sir Earl Grey is the grey on the extreme left hand side making a run with the duck on the outside also trying to get into the race here running on on the outside Spirit of Dover they come to the last 300 and Spirit of Dover comes home powerfully now down the inside Sir Earl Grey Sir Earl Grey on the inside and Spirit of Dover nearest us it's these two Spirit of Dover though and down the inside Sir Earl Grey but Sir Earl Grey will win it Second Spirit of Dober, then Colonel Bling and Winter Axe. Number 10, Sir Earl Grey, the son of the Sheikh, Garth Puller, Anton Marcus. Toad favourite at 2 rand 80, still very green. Anton didn't panic, he was about 8 lengths off him at the 800. Went through down the inside, and number 10 wins it by 2 lengths. Second will go to number 2, Spirit of Dover. Another 2.5 back to Colonel Bling. Further back is number 11, Winter Axe. As we continue to run it, then the duck followed further back in the field by Roy's horse, then forever, lucky shot, and they were followed by Roy's dream, and then there's a wall of them involved there, catch the fox, age of elegance. So the winner's on the extreme left-hand side, third time at the track, and Sir Earl Grey goes this distance for the first time. Stick in the left hand, you'll see still very green. Spirit of Dover's on the right, they race wide apart. And Sir Earl Grey still wants to drift towards the outside with the stick in the left hand, head twisted. But Sir Earl Grey is victorious. It pays up at 280, a race time 85.09. No result as yet. Back to the studio. A double for jockey Anton Marcus and uh, Gart Puller, the trainer, the grey son of the Sheikh, Sir Earl Grey, has uh, come off this uh, three-month break and into the number one box. Also, it's been quietly fancied in both his runs to date over shorter, and he's come to, to win a very good race. Well done to yourself and the patrons, Gart. Yeah, thanks. Uh, th you know, thanks to Mark Clausen and all the boys from Secunda. Uh, he's following, and um, and to Brian. I mean, this, you know, he's... He's been very green in all his starts, and you can see he didn't give uh, Anton any help here either. He was green, he didn't know where he is. He had a stick in his eye, and he's got one eye that doesn't, uh, he doesn't focus properly, mm. so he ducks for everything. So, yeah, it was a nice win, and it looks like he can come on a little bit. He's, uh, he probably wants a bit further. Well, you did the work. He was off for three months, so you had him pretty close to uh, uh, peak fitness. Yeah, he's a nice, he, he's, he's, he's a nice duo on the sand. He, he, he puts it in, he doesn't pull, but he, he, whatever I put him with, he can, he can match it. And uh, he just had to bring that to the races. His, his runs, previous runs with, uh, with uh, Mahudlo were, were good runs. I mean, he was never far off them from bad draws. So we thought he could have a winning chance today, and uh, he won nicely. Two more runners got. You got Echo Storm and Way of Light. And uh, Way of Light, you tried in the Million Rand race last time out, and Echo Storm is a decent stayer. Yeah, well, that was he qualified, and the owners were excited to have a runner there. Uh, he was he was out of his out of his depth there, but um, yeah, he doesn't he, he likes his course and he runs well. And Ecclestorm never runs a bad race, you know. So uh, you know, I'm just hoping for two nice runs, and I'd just like to say uh, thanks to everybody back home, Gary for his hard work, and uh, and uh, to Hollywood for the sponsorship. Well done, God. Thank you very much. God Puller, the winning trainer. Well done to the owners here of number ten, Sir Earl Grey, bred by the Fort Stud. Numbers you'll need here in race number five, a popular result in the jackpot with the favorite obliging number 10. You caught this quartet, two, uh, 10, 2, 1, and 11. That's uh, done and dusted the exotics, but we got nine races uh, carded this afternoon, so you can still get involved in all to comes, pick threes and doubles 
races six through to nine.